Hey guys, I hope you're doing well and welcome back to another video. So in this one, we are going to look at how we can add movies and logo motions to our Unreal projects. Here I have a package project and when I open it up, you can see that there is a logo motion for Unreal's logo. Next, we have another logo motion which can be your studios or your publisher's logo or whatever you like and next your game will be started so in this video we are going to look at how we can set this up this is actually very easy to set up you just need to go to the settings and project settings and here in the movies you can see that you have these two options and next you have this startup movies if you check this option it means that it will wait for the movies to complete and this is also pretty self-explanatory if you check this uh, the player can just click and skip the videos if you keep this unchecked they cannot skip the videos and they have to watch them uh, here i recommend checking this option so they can see the whole videos and here you can select the movies you want to play when the game is opened and that's it so the thing we need to do is to just go to the content browser and in the content folder create a new folder and call this movies next just right click and hit show in explorer so we have the folder in our folder structure in our project here is the location that i have made the project and as you can see when you open it up and go to the content folder you have this movies folder and here you should add the movies you want to play i want to play this two mp4 files first i want to have an unreal logo and next i want to have my studios logo so here is the unreal logo and as you can see it's an mp4 file with a very simple transition effect keep in mind that if you want to use unreal's logo for your project there is a license agreement form that you need to fill so just go to Unreal's website and here in this section you can see that there is an explanation about the logos and how you can use them in your project here you can see that they provide you with the logos in different formats and you can just use these files provided by the Unreal's website itself so just download one of these guys here and next if you want to turn it into a logo motion you can just use any software like premiere after effects canva or whatever you are uh, familiar with and add some transitions and turn it into a logo motion there is also this trademark license agreement form and if you want to uh, use these logos in your projects you need to fill it this is how it looks like and it's pretty simple and straightforward just fill this form and send it to this address here what i have done with the logo is that i just added it to my uh, editing software and then added this glitching transition and that's it the other video is this glitchy logo motion that i downloaded from this website here so if you just want to try this out you can download one of these pre-made logo motions or if you have a logo motion for your own studio you can use that file as well so just copy the videos in the movies folder and next all you need to do is to just go to the project settings and here select the videos so the first one is going to be the unreal logo and the other one is going to be my 
glitchy logo motion let's also delete this as well and that's it if you want to check this out you don't need to package the project you can just set this on standalone game and now you can see that when we play the game the movies are played before the game is opened and after the videos are finished your default level will be opened this is also the packaged file from this project and as you can see when you open up the exe file this will be shown to the player yeah that's it guys for this video and if you enjoyed it please leave a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel see you in the next one